lay one minute of knowledge on the Purple Daily community regarding this injury Bring and it. put our, our concerns at least a little bit more to bed. So in terms of Achilles tendon injuries, there's two factors that we need to think of. Number one, where did the rupture occur? Is it mid-substance, meaning that in the central area of the tendon, two to six centimeters proximal to where it attaches to your heel bone, or is it at the insertion of the heel bone? And I believe our sports that had mentioned at one point that it was an insertional tear for Brian. So already that's a better sign than having a mid-substance tear, okay? Number two, partial versus complete tear is a really big deal in regards to re-rupture rate after injury, as well as losing explosiveness after injury. Okay. So when Declan was saying things like, you know, I worry about, you know, big offensive linemen tearing their Achilles. Absolutely right. Look at a Phil Lodeholt towards Achilles 2015, retired the next year. Yep. When there's a mid-substance Achilles tear for these big linemen, it's almost a death sentence on the career. It's really hard to come back. However, with Brian's injury, it's partial. 